Hi everyone. Today is the fifth Sunday in Ordinary Time. So today's gospel tells us about what happened when Jesus called Simon to be his disciple. You know, later on in the gospels, Jesus changes Simon's name to Peter. So you're going to hear me um, interchange the names, Simon or Peter, and sometimes I'll say Simon Peter today. But I just want you to know who I'm talking about. Peter, okay? And so Simon, or Peter, was a fisherman. So I want you to listen carefully as I read today's gospel. A reading from the gospel of Luke. May Christ's word be on my mind, on my lips, and in my heart. One day, when Jesus was standing on the shore beside Lake Gennesaret, he saw two boats by the lake. The fishermen were busy washing their nets, but Jesus got to the boat that belonged to Simon, and he said to him, row the boat out where the water is deep, put your nets into the water, and you will catch some fish. Simon said, Master, we have fished all night long and didn't catch anything, but if you say so, we will try again. So they put their nets into the deep water. Soon they caught so many fish that their nets began to tear. They called to their partners in the other boat to come and help them. James and John came, and both boats were so full of fish that they almost sank. James and John were amazed at what happened. When Simon saw how many fish they caught, he fell down in front of Jesus and said, Lord, go away from me. I am a sinner. But Jesus said to Simon, do not be afraid. From now on, you will be gathering people, not fish. They brought their boats onto the shore, left everything, and followed Jesus. The Gospel of the Lord. And you all say, praise to uh, you, Lord Jesus Christ. So Simon or Peter hadn't caught any fish, but he trusted Jesus. He followed Jesus' command to lower the nets into the water again. So then what happened? They caught so many fish, the nets tore. Then Simon said to Jesus, Lord, go away from me, I'm a sinner. And why do you think he said that? Because he saw how truly holy Jesus is. And Jesus then forgave Simon his sins quickly and gave grace that Simon Peter needed for his new role. Jesus told Simon he would be a different kind of fisherman. What did Jesus say Peter would be catching instead of fish? He said he will be catching, let's see exactly how they worded in here, you will be catching people, not fish. Some translations say men. Jesus was calling Peter or Simon to help him bring people to God. Did Simon follow Jesus? Yes, he did. Jesus calls us to follow him too. One way that we follow Jesus is by telling others about him. I want you to think for a minute. Who is someone in your family that you might tell about Jesus and Simon Peter? You know, maybe you want to tell your mom or dad what you just learned or a brother or sister or a cousin an aunt and uncle or maybe even a friend I hope you take the time this week to tell others about Jesus so let's pray in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit amen and the response is going to be Lord hear our prayer for Pope Francis who leads the church into a deeper understanding respect and love for the word of God, that the wisdom of the Holy Spirit will always guide him. We pray to the Lord, Lord, hear our prayer for each other, that in listening to the word of God, we will respond with the generosity of the fishermen and follow Jesus with faith, commitment, and love. We pray to the Lord, Lord, hear our prayer and for all the intentions we hold in the silence of our hearts.
we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. I'm just going to say a quick little prayer. Lord Jesus, you called Peter and his friends to follow you, and you have called each of us as well. Help us to trust in you as Peter did, and make our faith grow stronger every day. Amen. Just a quick note. For those of you adults who sometimes watch this, um, I just want to tell you that this scene is captured so amazingly on um, The Chosen. You can find it on YouTube under episode um, season one, episode three and four specifically, episode four. It's really captured beautifully. So if you haven't watched The Chosen yet, I encourage you to do so. But um, it is um, meant for adults and not for the children. Okay, everyone, have a great day. God bless. Bye.